Welcome to this in-depth review of OV Cloud, one of the most discussed hosting providers in the tech community. Today, I'll be walking you through the real-world experience of using OV Cloud for hosting, including its control panel interface, setup process, speed, support, and overall reliability from a user's perspective. As someone who has spent a considerable amount of time exploring its VPS and cloud solutions, I want to share everything, the good, the bad, and everything in between. Starting off, the registration and server deployment process on OV Cloud is fairly straightforward, but not as intuitive as some of its competitors. If you're new to hosting, the interface might feel a bit overwhelming. There's a learning curve, especially with its custom dashboard and the sheer number of server options. However, once you're in, the flexibility offered is impressive. You can customize almost every aspect of your server configuration, from the operating system to the number of cores and storage type. The pricing structure is transparent but tiered. You can expect to pay more for performance, but unlike some budget hosts, OV Cloud actually delivers on its advertised specs. During testing, the server performance was stable, especially under load. Ping times and uptime were generally excellent. Still, be aware that support is very limited unless you pay for a higher tier plan, and even then, the response time isn't always ideal. And just when it felt like everything was lagging, Altahost turned out to be the one solution that simply works. This and many other useful links you can find in the description. Returning to OV Cloud, one of the major pros is its global data center presence. This gives you the advantage of choosing a location close to your audience, which noticeably improves latency. For developers and system admins who want full control, all clouds, bare metal servers, and advanced networking options are a huge plus. The DDoS protection is built in, which is essential today, and their infrastructure overall feels solid and enterprise grade. But not everything is perfect. The documentation, while extensive, is not always up to date or easy to understand. Some of the advanced configurations require a solid understanding of Linux server management. And while there is a community forum, it's not the most active or helpful for urgent issues. So is OV Cloud worth it? If you're an experienced user or a developer looking for scalable infrastructure with real performance under pressure, then yes, it holds up very well. But for beginners or small site owners needing simple setup and responsive support, there might be better alternatives out there. If this honest review helped you, don't forget to hit that like button subscribe for more tech breakdowns, and tap the bell icon to stay updated. Thanks for watching.